Yo, this animation looks kinda good actually. Surprisingly. <laughs> I mean, that dude's eyes looks a bit weird though. <laughs> Uh -huh, weird camera angle as expected. Ah, that place looks pretty nice. Waifu number one right there. Husbando number one right over there. Uh huh. I guess that's our booster character. Is that a villain? I guess. I mean, she's wearing purple and covered, you know, in an all black building. Oh, that's villain number two then. Only it's a rival. I guess it's a rival or something. You know, red and blue. I can see it. I can see it. Are they like married or something? Cause I don't really know these characters, but from the scenes, I presume so. Ooh, two moons. Interesting. So this is definitely not our planet then. All right, all right. For an anime intro, I say that's pretty good. So good day, everybody. You guys all just saw the intro to Tales of Arise. I'm pretty excited to start this game because truth be told, there hasn't really been. Mm, much of oh no don't play come on i'm doing my intro right here <laughs> anyway as i was saying there hasn't been much of a good jrpg this past few months i'd say i mean aside from shin megabi tensei 5 i guess and uh, i guess the persona series is still around but other than that you know there hasn't been much of an rpg game they had wow stop come on it's just been a few seconds so yeah i've haven't actually played any of the previous Tales game. I think there was one called Tales of Vesperia, I think, for the PS2 or PS1, maybe. Uh, I'm sure somebody in the comments will correct me. But yeah, I don't actually know anything about this game. I haven't watched any trailer, haven't read up any reviews. Well, I mean, I guess I did saw the ratings for the game. So far, most seems to say that the game is really good, actually. Like, it's getting 4.5 out of 5 stars and all that. So that's a, that's a good sign. And I think I've heard one or two comments say that the gameplay is actually one of its most exciting element compared to previous Tales game. So that's another plus point. Because the issue I have with most RPG games is that yeah, the story and characters are tremendous and amazing. But sometimes it does get a bit dull when you're grinding away and all you do is press the same abilities you know over and over for each battle as you try to level up your characters so having a fun gameplay is you know i think it's turning to be a must for me now these days because i do play games to feel you know to feel excited and to feel fun so without further ado let's jump right into it all right the first boss of any game, the option screen. I uh, don't really know what these stars mean, but I guess everything should be fine. Save and begin. Begin a new game, please. Alright, I am actually excited to start a new RPG game now. Let's see if what the comments says are true. And of course, I have my eye on one specific character. I, I think you guys probably know what it is from my reactions to the intro of this game. Uh, just a little hint. Uh, she, she uses guns. So, yep. <laughs> Kamigami 
Yo, these these nights are, are fucked, man. <laughs> Yo, wait, what about the spaceship is there? Oh, there they are. Uh-huh. So, nights on... 300 years ago only? Holy shit. That's not that too far. That's like, compared to our time. The 17th century. Mm, I mean, the flag is a skull, so <laughs> that says something. そしてレナの兵士に苛まれなく終わりのない苦しみの終わりを告げるもの。誰がそう信じていた？You know, aliens coming in, taking your resources. And enslaving the original people on the land sounds like colonialism to me, man. Sounds like it's a bit of colonialism going on there. <laughs> Alright, so just to summarize, Renan, some sort of aliens came in, destroyed the planet, which was, I guess, an allegory to heaven and then they enslave all the people split it into five nations but i think only the one with the skull flag got enslaved not sure what the other four are doing okay they're fine oh wow i love title cards tales of arise ladies and gentlemen no 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 Screen tear, no. <laughs> okay, all right. Everything seems to be back in order, I think. Oh man, I I hope the FPS won't do that again. That was really unexpected. Everything was going so smoothly. Oh wait, is that is that our planet? I guess they're on some sort of moon. Dude, what are you expecting? I mean, I know you guys are like slave masters. But surely you know this doesn't look sensible at all. <laughs> Iron Mask? <laughs> Slave support group. <laughs> you know that sounds bad. I'm laughing at but <laughs> slave support group. <laughs> That's a very quiet barrel. I expected there to be like some sort of rolling sound. Whoa. Iron mask. I don't know why. <laughs> I cool. Hmm. 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 Alright, Mr. Iron Mask. I, I don't know if you should be wearing the mask in such a hot place. I mean... You know. Let's see Mr. Slave Support Group. Hey, no loitering. Embedded. What is... I guess embedded is the term for slave here, I guess. Move. Can I run? Nope, can't able to run right now. E to talk. Cool. I'm so sorry, Iron Mask. You got hurt because of me. That's right, child. 
don't sweat it, kid. Uh, Mr. Iron Mask, I think everybody's sweating right here. It's not like I felt anything. But that's why Doc tells you to be extra careful, doesn't he? Yeah, but at the end of the day, I chose to stick my neck out for you and I don't regret a thing. So don't sweat it, Cole, okay? Okay. Thanks, Iron Mask. <laughs> Sound like some sort of like Kansai Ranger or something. <laughs> oh no, it's I'm. Um... Say dog, what's your opinion on wearing this mask? Surely you would know that there's some issues about it, right? Ah. Oh, what? I have no f- Ah, uh, yeah, I am wearing a mask. <laughs> I thought he meant like physically there's no face underneath it. <laughs> what the why doesn't anyone stand and fight? I don't know. They have spaceships and a suit of armor. <laughs> I don't think you guys could do much about it right now. I'm not saying you guys sh should accept your living conditions. Yeah, if only it was so simple, man. Doc knows what's going on. He's using his brains. Mm -hmm. That's right, Doc. Oh no, don't tell me he's going to die. Yeah, that's right. Because you're that's right, Doc. Doc is a smart one right here. <laughs> Sigma male Doc versus Alpha Iron Mask Man. <laughs> breeze! Alright, Doc, come on, look around you. It's gonna be a super hot breeze. I don't think you'll enjoy that. <laughs> Yeah, I was just about to say, low profile, he's literally wearing a mask. <laughs> he can't go anywhere without people going, Yo, that's Iron Mask right there. Rest in your assigned bed. Sick. Hey Cole, are you just following me around? Are you okay? Thanks for saving me earlier. That's all. Yep, seems like it. Hello sir. Is this the way to my bed? No, you're pointing at? Uh, hey, you okay, buddy? The bright eyes stick these weird stones on our bodies and then work us to the bones until we're dead. What stones? I don't see any stones on me or on you. And I see if the routine beatings from them weren't enough when they're in a re- Uh, <laughs> hey, uh, we're just having a, a nice chat right here. <laughs> Uh, yeah, no worries. Y you okay, buddy? You you're shivering a lot. <laughs> uh, are you cold? Maybe there is an air conditioning unit inside your armor. <laughs> Alright, anyway. <laughs> and as if the routine beatings from them weren't enough, <laughs> when they're in a really bad mood, <laughs> they like to stick their zoogles on us. Oh, there he goes. Alright, I guess the zoogles are the dogs. Alright. I'm a slave. That's right. A spirit core? Ah, it's the stones. What are you looking at? Are you looking to get your ass kicked too? Renan armored soldier. No, thank you, sir. My assigned bin. Oh, look, there's a stairs up here. Oh, there's a Zuko. Grrr. Alright, point taken. Every last 
one of your embedders will die and then we can do whatever we want with you now burn <laughs> uh typical villains are you gonna eat that my assigned bait sigh not matter not matter how tired you get of seeing them guess so be no matter right I mean, he is tired. Uh, you can always find Rena and Lenagis hanging up in the sky. Guess that's the moon. There. Okay. I hate it. It's like you're watching over us, keeping an eye on our every move. So I guess that's the alien's homeworld, I guess? That Lenagis especially is something else. There's no way we can ever hope to beat the Renans when they can build floating castles like that. So Lenagis are the... I thought the Renans were the aliens. Oh no, the Renans are the aliens. So Lenagis is maybe the planet, I guess? Get to bed embedded now. Dude, I I'm just trying to talk to people. Alright, alright, I won't go near there. I thought that was my house, man. Ever wondered why those bright eyes like to burn all over the place? I'll tell you, it's a fuel they make us mine for. Uh-huh. There's no reason for us to do it. Once we do, they just take it and light it up. And that's why it's hotter than hell here. Hello, do you know where my house is? Listen, whatever that bastards do to you, don't even think about trying to fight back against them bright eyes, got it? They keep calling them bright eyes, but I don't think I've seen their eyes yet. I know, I know. Not like any of us have a chance in hell of ever beating one of those soldiers or just zoogles, let alone Lord Balsef. Balsef? Balsef. Shush. Don't talk about this in public, you two. Who knows what they'll do if they hear you guys. Don't worry, Iron Mask is here. Is this my house? Nope. Hello, what are you trying to do? No approaching the water without permissions embedded. Water? Oh, oh that must be the well. Mm, Alright. Hello? Hey. Can't it wait, Iron Mask? I'm trying to catch a little shut eye over here. Well, chill out, dude. I didn't know you didn't want to talk to me. You had a speech bubble over your head. Rest. Alright. Is that a brick for a pillow? Jesus Christ, at least get like a cloth or something. Well, so far things are not looking good for us. <laughs> and then suddenly cheery music. <laughs> 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 that didn't seem like a good match. <laughs> Alright, back to work. I'm gonna be slave number one. They're gonna put me on the slave of the month at least. And then maybe I'll get extra rations for the day. What are you doing? You better go to your assigned position before the bright eyes beat you. I don't see any eyes on them. I mean, I see their eye holes, but they're not glowing or anything. Yep, alright, I get it. Hey dog. Oh, people are queuing up. I'm surprised they let... Like, at least they allow a clinic to be run here, you know. I, I thought they could make dog like go to like, some of the mining stations or something. How are your injuries? Don't get up to anything too reckless out there, alright? I, I mean, dog sounds like a badass grandpa, so I don't think... No, it'll be more badass if he does sound like that and still beat up people's asses. That's all. Alright. Can't wait to see dog leading the revolution, you know. I'm here for the freight hauling duty. All right. <laughs> Wait, what's going? No, not another. Okay, there we go. I think it's like loading in the graphics or something. Oh. Oh, they're using the the dogs. Wow, that's a fucking fast dog right there. Ah, <laughs> oh, enemy cutscenes, I love it. Fuck yeah. <gasps> Cowboy trap. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Groans of pain. It's the revolution. <gasps> Waifu number one! 
That's not minerals. Yo, <laughs> let's go. <laughs> no wonder they were transporting this. I, I want to, you know, I totally take over a planet if I see her on it. <gasps> Yo. Fuck. She killed him! What? Wait. What? Where, where is she going? She's like, yo, I'm getting the fuck out of here. Girl, where are you going? The whole place is a desert. You can't survive out there. <laughs> Even the guards are like, yo, come back here! <laughs> Running in high heels. Anime trope right there. 